Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna take a look at the Duji V30T. Now you can pick this one up online, I'll throw the link up in the description. The price on this one is 500 bucks. Now on a side note, if you like what you see and you wanna shop around a little bit, the cheapest I found it for was on AliExpress for 310 bucks. Now at 310 bucks, this is the perfect trap phone. And I'm gonna show you why. All right, so let's go through the specs real quick. Now this one comes in three different colors. You got marble black, rose gold, and galaxy gray. For the display, you got a 6.58 inch IPS LCD display with a resolution of 1080 by 2400. Now that's 401 for the PPI Patrol. The phone is IP68 and IP69K dust, water, and concrete resistant. That's military standard 810H. This phone is a tank. Now you got Gorilla Gas 5 on the front for protection and a 120 hertz refresh rate. For the processor, you got the MediaTek Dimensity 1080 with the Mali G68 GPU. Now what does that mean in English? Mid-range specs, bro, mid-range specs. Now you got 12 gigs of RAM, which is upgradable to 20. You got 256 gigs of storage, which you can expand up to two terabytes. Now it's running Android 12 with Doogee's stock skin on top. Now check this out. This is the best part about this phone, the battery. You got a 10,800 milliamp battery that features 66 watt fast charge. That means you can charge this phone from zero to 55% in 30 minutes. Now with regular use, this phone is gonna last you between three to five days. And for standby time, up to 30 days. This is incredible and I'm gonna show and prove. Now for the cameras, on the rear you got a triple setup. So you got a 108 megapixel main camera, a 20 megapixel night vision camera, and a 16 megapixel wide angle slash macro lens. On the front, you got a 32 megapixel camera and you can shoot 4K video from the front and on the rear. Now you got Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, NFC, face unlock, and a side mounted fingerprint sensor. All right, so all of that for 500 bucks, what's missing? No headphone jack, that shit's whack, hashtag bars. Other than that, this is the perfect trap phone. And when I say trap phone, I mean work phone, okay? Secondary phone or your main phone. If you're looking for a phone that has an unbelievable battery and it's built like a tank, this is it right here. All right, so let's unbox it and see what it is. Shout out to White Shoes, she got the day off. Here we go, Doogee V30T, okay? 20 gigs, okay, 256 storage. Smart life for you. Okay, <laughs> and of course, no days off. Ladies and gentlemen, late but still great, White Shoes is back in the building. I love my White Shoes. I love my White Shoes. I love my White Shoes. White Shoes, turn down. Okay, here we go. Inside the box. Okay, now this is gonna be your device. <laughs> this is a brick right here. Let's see, limited warranty, plug it and file it. Now it does come with screen protector. Let's see what this is. Okay, screen protector accessories. Usual books and shit, plug them and follow them. Got your charging brick in the box. Why not? Samsung, Google, Apple, pay attention. And this is gonna be USB Type-C to USB Type-C charging cable. All right, shoes got and inspect that for quality and scoot, scoot. Now for the actual device, plastic off. One more, right. here we go, Doogee V30T. Like I said, this thing is built like a tank, okay? You cannot break this phone. All right, so let me uh, power this up, delete my browsing history, and then we'll walk through the OS. Talk amongst yourselves. All right, y'all, so we back in. First, let's talk about the weight of this phone. Now, this is a big, indestructible tank, but it does come with some extra weight. And just for comparison, here's your standard cell phone, okay? This is a Google Pixel 7 Pro. Now this one weighs 211 grams. Now here's a heavy cell phone, Asus ROG. This one weighs 244. Check the weight of the V30T. This one is 386 grams. So all of that protection does come with some extra weight. All right, so now let's talk about the build quality. First of all, this is a beast, okay? You cannot break this phone. You can drop it on the concrete. You can run over it with a car. 
trust me when I tell you, this is indestructible. On one side, you got your power button slash fingerprint sensor. You got your volume rockers. And if you notice, it has a nice little texture to it. You got your screws right there. On the back, triple camera setup. There's your LED flash, night vision. Okay, now one more side note. The night vision on this camera is pretty dope. And I'm gonna show you a crazy test that I did. On the other side, here's your SIM tray slash micro SD card slot. You got a multifunctional button, which also has ridges. And this is fully customizable. You can see some more screws. On the bottom, this is gonna be your USB Type-C charging slot. And since everything is fully water resistant, has a nice little cover on it. You got speaker grills on the bottom, speaker grills on the top. There's your front facing camera. Again, this phone does have some hefty weight to it, but a lot of y'all are looking for these rugged phones. This is the definition of a rugged phone. All right, so there's a couple of different ways you can open up your device. You can just pick it up, look at it, face unlock. You see how fast that works? Let's do it again. Bang. Let's do one more. Bang. Next, you can swipe up, put in your pad and your pin. And lastly, you have your side mounted fingerprint sensor, which again, works flawlessly. Bang, let's do one more. Bang. All right, now this is the global ROM. So if you swipe over once, you're gonna see your Google homepage. Let's swipe down. You got all your quick toggles. Anything we need to see here, hotspot, NFC. You got 5G, underwater camera, okay? That explains that flap right there. You got a fully functional underwater camera. Okay, of course you got screen record and screen capture. All right, so let's check the uh, basic settings. You got NFC, screencast, nearby share, Android Auto, hotspot and tethering, VPNs, and private DNS for your scumbag activities. Let's see, let's go to notifications, anything we need to see here. Everything is pretty standard. Okay, you do have enhanced notifications. Let's go to display. Now I got it on dark mode. Max brightness. Okay, let's see anything else. Screen refresh rate, 60 hertz, 90 hertz, or 120. Now with a phone that has a battery like this, you might as well leave it on 120 hertz. But if you want to, you can put it on auto. Now, real quick, speaking of battery, let's see how much battery I got on this. 84%. Now this is a true story. I unboxed this phone on Wednesday. Okay, today's Friday afternoon. Okay, it's 1243 Friday afternoon. I unboxed this phone Wednesday morning, set everything up, started taking my daytime photos, my nighttime photos, putting all my apps in. As you can see, everything is on deck. The battery life on this is at 87%, now actually 86. This is after almost three days. So when they say three to five days regular use, they are not joking. This thing is a bohemian. okay? <laughs> Big words alert. Let's see anything else. Okay, lift to awake, we leave that on. Let's go to sound, okay? Dual stereo speakers. Nice and loud, okay? Let's go to uh, security. Okay, so of course you got face unlock, fingerprint sensor, you got smart lock, okay? Let's go to uh, passwords and account, nothing to really see there, apps. Okay, all of your apps, battery, <laughs> okay, 84%. <laughs> this is crazy. Uh, this is the perfect trap phone because one of the things that you want on your trap phone or work phone, you want it to be rugged and durable and you want that battery to last for days. Okay, you could leave this in your car for a couple of days, pull it out the car and check this out. Still got plenty of battery left. Storage, okay, 256 gigs. Let's see, accessibility, if you're hearing or visually impaired, all your settings on deck, privacy, okay, full privacy suite, location, fingerprint. Okay, check this out, side key function. For one click, now if you want to, you can have it open a specific app. You can have it like I got it right now with no in, uh, no operation because I accidentally, uh, accidentally press it a lot. But let's set it to flashlight, okay? One click, flashlight, look at this. <laughs> One click, flashlight. All I'm doing is pressing the button, flashlight, that's pretty dope. All right, so that's one click. For double click, same thing, all of the same settings, but if you want to, I'm gonna set mine on screenshot for double click, and long press, let's do uh, open up game mode. So this does have a gaming mode. So let's try that out right now, double press, screenshot, long press, 
There's your game mode. Okay, so everything works. We'll, we'll, we'll check out some gaming in a minute. Press and hold. <laughs> Let's exit game mode. Okay, hold. <laughs> okay, let's go back to settings. All right, let's see anything else. Uh, digital well-being and parent parental control. Monitor your scumbag activities. Memory expansion. Okay. Okay. Restart the phone. Let's get some more memory. All right, so for that feature, you're going to have to do a quick reset. That's your memory expansion. Next, you got door speed. What is that? Dora Speed helps boost the foreground apps by restricting background apps. Some notifications may be postponed or not received. Okay, so that's Dora Speed. You got safety and emergency. Okay, so you got your emergency SOS. Like I said, this might be one of your trap phones in the car. You got smart assist. Okay, smart touch gesture motions. Let's see, we got three finger screenshots. Leave that on. Three point entry, two point just volume, double click. Okay, so you do have a few gestures system okay updates resets and about phone okay so this is the v30t okay look added three gigs of extra ram after that reset real nice now as you can see okay you swipe up got screenshot clear all all of my standard android widgets and this phone is running nice and smooth like i said this is mid-range processor Let's check the uh, browsing speeds. Go to apple.com. Opening web page. Okay. Full website. Nice and smooth. 120 hertz refresh rate. Let's do some uh, split screen multitasking. Let's do uh, something else on the bottom. Go to samsung.com. Opening web page. Okay, let's do Facebook and Samsung at the same time. All right, so we got Facebook on the bottom, Samsung on the top. Multitasking like a beast. And remember, you can't do this on your iPhone. I always got to point that out. All right, so now let's try out the dual stereo speakers. And of course, I got the official Flossy Carter sound test by my homeboy, Mark Rubier. Here we go. Yo, sound test. Nice and loud. Okay, not the most bass in the world. I'm gonna cover up the bottom. This is just the top. Okay. How's the sound, white shoes? How's the sound on it? Ladies and gentlemen, Mark Rabier. Not the most bass in the world, but definitely loud enough to get the job done, and I'll always take dual speakers over one bottom firing speaker any day of the week. All right, so now let's take a look at this 6.5 inch full HD IPS LCD display. Here we go. Full screen. Here, drop cutout. Okay, there's your viewing angles. Got some bezels on here. Real beautiful. Here's how it's gonna look when you're watching your videos. All right, let's keep it moving. All right, so now let's try a little gaming. And of course, I got Asphalt 9 queued up. Don't forget, you do have a dedicated gaming mode. Here we go. 
All right. I need to catch up. I can't lose two times in a row. Y'all seen the last video? I accidentally lost. I'm playing for the win now. I gotta catch this white car right here. I still gotta stick my landing up. Oh, I almost wrapped. Can I get him at the end? Got him. All right, let's, let's do a little showboating. Why not? We got a comfortable lead. All right, there it is. I almost hit that hydrant. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so gaming on this phone, no issues at all. All right, so now let's talk about the camera. Now you got a bunch of different shooting modes. You got night vision, which I'm gonna show you a quick example of how I used it, and it's actually pretty dope. You got videos, okay, you can shoot wide angle all the way up to four times zoom. And of course you got 4K resolution for the front and on the back. For pictures, you got wide angle, all the way up to four times zoom. You got 108 megapixels, you got beauty, and you got more. So you got pro mode, portrait, you got your GIFs, you got panorama, slow motion, mono, bokeh effects, and QR code. Now the bokeh is gonna be your portrait mode. Now let me talk about night vision for a minute. Let me show you something. All right, now I'm gonna post this video in a few seconds, but let me just explain what you're looking at. You see, there's a dark little corner right here and I drop my keys on the floor, you can't see them with the naked eye. Then I put on a night vision, and look at that. That is pretty dope. Okay, so the night vision camera actually works. Take a look at these test pictures and videos for yourself.
Now let's do the RDA test, regular daily activities. Now this is important. You're spending anywhere between three and 500 bucks on the phone. Let's see how it works in the real world. Now there's no always on display, no wireless charge, but check this out. Now this is a feature I've been crying to Samsung about. Notification LED. Y'all remember these? This lets you know you got a missed notification. All right, so you wake up in the morning, grab your phone, just pick it up and look at it. Bong, face unlock, works flawlessly. First thing I like to do, check the weather. Okay, 66 degrees, nice and sunny. Exit out of that. Next, let's go to Google. Let's get a fresh little refresh. Okay, see what's going down on the Google homepage. As of right now, we can see Vivo X2. Okay, Motorola Edge. Okay, Vivo S17, bunch of new phones coming out. Okay, Apple Beat Studio Buds Plus. Okay, new beats coming out. Okay, let's see some new movies, PlayStation games, Redmi Note 12. Okay, that looks good. Best laptop for photography editing. Okay, okay. Top Gun, okay, one of my favorite movies. You know what I'm saying? America. All right, let's see what's up with Shaq Diesel. Okay, anyway, so here's how your Google page is gonna look. Okay, scroll through, wake up in the morning, check all your news. Okay, now who got the Street Fighter 6 demo? Downloaded it yesterday. I'm already a kind of a beast. Okay, anyway, so there's your Google homepage. Exit out of that. Next, let's do some work. Okay, so let's click on Gmails. Now, this is one of my favorite new shops. It's called Uncrate. So I ordered a bunch of stuff from there. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's my work stuff. A bunch of, bunch of products I just ordered. My shipment is about to come in. Let's um, hit reply. Okay. Thanks. Bang, there it is. So that's how it's going to look when you're doing your work emails. Because a lot of y'all going to buy this big, rugged, heavy-duty phone for work. So this is how it's going to look like when you're doing your work emails. Nice and smooth. 120 hertz refresh rate. No issues. Okay. And you got your Google widgets. All right. So that's the work segment of the day. Let's uh, take it over to Twitter. Okay. So let's see what's going down on Twitter. Which color... Xiaomi 13 Ultra looks the best, green. The white looks kind of dope too though, but that green is fire. All right, let's go to uh, mentions to see anybody talking about me. Now I haven't checked Twitter in a couple of days, so let's see. Asking a non-tech friend to watch a 30 minute F Flossy Carter video? Well, let's see. <laughs> okay, well, you know, I I I'll read that later. Let's, let's, let's see, is he roasting? <laughs> well, you know, look man, if you want quality, this is where you got to come from. Now, if you if you want quantity, uh, if you just want a short quantity video, go watch somebody else. But if you want quality reviews, bring your ass right here. Okay, I'm giving quality over quantity, bro. All right, so let's see. Anything else? <laughs> okay. Look, my Flossy Carter videos are way too long. Look, man, this is not a sales commercial. This is a review. Now, a lot of y'all out there, y'all just want to see a quick somebody read off the specs and just, oh, take a quick picture. No, that's not how it works. This is a review. Okay, matter of fact, let me let me let me get let me, why did I like that? Let me get a reply to that. Let me go ahead and reply to that right now. I make let's do that. I make reviews. Okay. Not you gotta use proper punctuation. Okay, not sales commercials. Shoes is trolling me. And of course you gotta put the S at the end. And you throw a little emoji. Even though I'm not really laughing, but you gotta <laughs> You got LOL. Meanwhile, I got the straightest face ever. And you let people know, man. Get out of here, man. If you don't like it, get out of here. This is why I don't be on Twitter too much, because you know, Twitter, Twitter be making me want to just react, yo. <laughs> so I'll be ready to react on Twitter, yo, yurt. All right, let's, let's get out of this tweet, yo, because I let's get out of that. Let's see. OnePlus got some new stuff coming out. Okay, what's this? Uh, let's see. Samsung Mobile 23 Plus. Okay. Oh, I got the Plus, too. That's pretty dope. All right, so anyway, here's how your tweet's going to look. As you see for yourself. Now, if you want to, you can just turn on dark mode. Okay. Bang. There it is. Okay. So that's Twitter. Let me get out of Twitter because Twitter be making me want to punch one of y'all. All right. Let's um. Let's let's let's, let's do something that uh, a little bit more. Now let's go to Facebook. Now even though Fa Twitter be making me want to punch one of y'all, but Facebook be making me appreciate life because every time I come to Facebook, I see some RIP posts. But let's see. Let's see. Let's, let's see if we can start Friday off right. With some good vibes, yeah. All right, everybody graduating. Oh, this is my niece right here. Let me go ahead and let me go ahead and like that. My niece getting ready to graduate. Okay, that's how you know I'm getting old, bro. I remember we was trying to sneak on to the rods at Six Flags, yeah. Damn, bro, time flies, yeah. Anyway, so here's how your Facebook is gonna look. 
Okay, this is my nephew right here. All right, this is my nephew who be making the music for me. I told y'all he getting ready to blow up. You see him right here with uh, Conway. All right, he getting ready to get down with Griselda Records. You know what I'm saying? Proud of that guy. All right, anyway, so here's um here's your Facebook. Status Buds, I'm about to do those two. Exit out. Now, again, if you want to, you can do a little split screen multitasking. Okay, so we got Facebook and Twitter on the bottom. And again, the reason I do these kind of tests, I can take any phone on the planet. I can take the cheapest, most garbage budget phone in the world and edit out a quick video and you'll think it's dope. But then when you get it, you try to do split screen multitasking, everything is lagging. You try to open up two apps at the same time, everything is lagging and freezing. I like to do this live so you can see how the phone is actually gonna work in the real world. Okay, now let's exit out of that. Where was we? Okay, this is what I was trying to show y'all. Multiple apps open at the same time. If you want to, let's just clean it up. Bang, there it is. All right, so let's take it over to TikTok. For TikTok, we need to lower the volume. Unless we're getting ready to see a good slap, then we might as well put the volume back up. Hold up, what, what was that, what was that? Hold up, I missed that. Oh, I missed it, I missed it. Why did I go over to, why did I go to the refresh? All right, anyway. Okay, so we got, of course, we're going to have a bunch of skits. That video is going to pop back up, uh, I'm pretty sure, because I follow a lot of slap videos. I follow, oh, ooh. That was a little two-piece right there. Oh, <laughs> that was a little two-piece. That was, y'all see that? That was a little quick two-piece. <laughs> that was a little quick two-piece right there. No biscuit. All right, let's see. Anything else? All right, so here's how your TikTok is going to look. Okay. Okay, my, my, my dude right here, boy. <laughs> Dudes be you know, coming fresh out the gym. I respect that though. I respect that though. You know what I'm saying? Cause I, you know what I'm saying? Now, when I work out, I'm, uh, people who work out respect other people who work out because we know how much work it takes to look like that. That's why I don't look like that no more. <laughs> That's it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is this, yeah? This is a mosh pit? <laughs> I do not want to go to no parties like this. <laughs> I might've had, I'm gonna get who like you. I might've had fun at a party like this back in the day, is it? <laughs> I don't know, I came up in there ready for a warfare. Yeah. All right, anyway. Okay. We got the real versus fake sneakers. Look, I, I said this again now. If you got to take a set of sneakers and do all of this to find out if it's real or fake, <laughs> that lets you know the real sneakers game is over. Okay, I am not buying no more real sneakers if you got to be doing all these videos to show, oh, look at the stitching. Bro, nobody cares about that, man. Okay, here we go. I told you it's coming back around. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get a little sound. Rakata! Rakata! Hold up. Wow. Let's see that one more time. Hold up. Mm. Y'all wonder why that's my new favorite sport, yo. Damn, yo. <sighs> okay, anyway, let's take it over to Instagram. Wrap this segment up. Oh, so, oh, okay. This is a family show. <laughs> uh, okay, shout out to RK Tunes. This is where I get my uh, my cars tuned up at. They was doing a giveaway. Somebody actually won this. I was trying to win this, man. I'm trying to start a whole fleet of old school red beamers, yeah. All right, that's my goal for the next five years. All right, anyway, let's see. Okay, okay let's see. Okay, now who y'all got? Y'all got um y'all got Ryan or y'all got Tank Davis? I got my money on Tank. I don't know, man. Yeah, I don't know. Let's see what um, how am Haney talking about? He probably talking some smack, but I got my money on uh, Tank. Who y'all got? Okay. Uh, of course, I got to see. I got to see some cute dog videos, and of course, my favorite, cute cat videos. <laughs> this is my favorite thing I like to see on Instagram. Okay, let's see anything else. Okay, anyway, get your, get your little scroll on, yo. You know what I mean? <laughs> Cat, look at the cat giving it up for all these fans. Okay, do your thing, Shorty. Do your thing. Anyway, so here's how your Instagram. Here's how your Instagram is gonna look. <laughs> I don't even want. I'm not even scrolling back up, bro. I'm not doing it. <laughs> Yo, free free YSL. Anyway, so let's exit out of that. Now let's check one more thing. Let's go to uh, videos. Okay, let's uh, click on a video. Previously, exit out of that. On Jimmy Kimmel Live. And if you notice, turn the volume down. If you notice, you got your picture and picture for YouTube. Exit out of that. RDA, regular daily activities. This phone is going to work perfectly fine. No stutters, no hiccups, no lag. Everything is on deck. Let's go ahead and wrap this up. Overall, 
On a scale of one to 10, I'm gonna give this phone a major, major go. If you're looking for a hardcore, rugged phone that you could just come in the house, bang, drop it on the table, this is pretty dope. Now, let me say one more thing. A lot of people have been asking me to review these rugged phones, and um, honestly, I like this, because if you watch my channel, y'all know one of the things that I love about my flagship phones, I like them to be big and heavy and manly and brolic. Brolic is a word that we use, that means, that means big and, and bulky. I kind of like this. So this way, when I put that phone down somewhere, I ain't gotta be babysitting it, I can just throw it everywhere. This phone is a tank. And speaking of tank, the battery life. Now let's see, after all of that, now I haven't, let's see, let's, let's go to battery. Look at this. It's at 78%. Matter of fact, let's go to battery because I got my glasses on. 78%. Okay, when I started the video, it was at 87%. It's at 78%. After all of this stuff, I haven't plugged it in, I haven't charged it. The battery life on this phone is incredible. Okay, and again, that's what you want from your work phone or your rugged phone, or even if you just like to have this as your personal only phone. Okay, not only fans. If you want this as your only phone, you're gonna have to charge this up every three days. Now, if you put maximum hardcore heavy use, and like you see, I got max brightness, 120 hertz refresh rate. Still, you're getting you're 100 percent getting two days. But if you tone everything down, you could get up to five days on one charge. So when you go on vacation, this is the kind of phone to bring with you. Charge it up once and rock out for your whole vacation. This is pretty dope. And as you can see, the camera's actually decent. Nighttime photos, eh, whatever. Night vision, okay, night vision works so dope, okay? That's a nice little gimmicky feature. Some might call it gimmicky, but if you work at nighttime, you're gonna like that feature. This is an all-around beast right here. Anyway, Duji V30T, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this one. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Boxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time. 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know. Stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Oh yeah. Special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat. Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. I see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes. The picture be rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Spock one to beam up. some of that technology you gotta understand certain things subscribe to Flossy Carter he does reviews of all the latest technology the iPhones, the iPads, the Galaxies, the Samsungs, whatever the fuck the Beats by that doctor guy and he puts his kitty cat in the videos too for you something to look at you know I'm an animal lover so I like that shit so make sure you hit the subscribe button, the Flossy Carter on the YouTube, the follow button on the Insta face, and the like button on the face look. Because if you don't, we're going to have a fucking problem here. A bad one. Now hit the fucking subscribe button.